It's October 22nd, and I'm out on a chunk of private. And I learned this morning that the neighbor behind us here has got an apple tree. I couldn't see that until the leaves started dropping. And ended up, I was using my grunt call and threw out a few grunts and noticed some movement over by that apple tree. I thought it was a doe, but ended up being a buck. So I gave another grunt and he was coming in my direction and he got behind a big patch of brush. So I got everything settled and then I dropped my grunt call. And it landed on top of an old stand that's sitting at the bottom of this tree. So he never, I never saw him, never heard him blow, never heard him run off. He just kind of disappeared. But that was the only excitement I had today. It's about 10.30. I'm gonna wrap it up for a morning set. One tip, make sure your grunt call is actually looped onto something before you let go of it. It is Sunday, October 23rd. It's about three o'clock. I'm headed back out to the piece of private that I have permission on. I hunted there this morning and I had all sorts of action in the morning. I saw, I don't know, probably about 15 deer. Every single one of them does. Most of them were, you know, out 100 yards out in the homeowner's yard. Uh, but I had a few that came into range. They were just babies though. Uh, a little button buck, a little fawn. Wasn't going to shoot those. Uh, but it was cool. Got some practice just drawing on them. But they were totally oblivious to me. They were downwind. Didn't ever smell me. Didn't see me. I was talking into the camera and they didn't even hear it. Um, I did use a bunch of scent spray and nose jammer. Not a single one of them had an issue crossing the road that I'd walked in on or anything so that was that was cool to see uh, but I had to leave for church in the morning and when I got down there was does standing in the driveway and unfortunately I had to just kind of bump them out of there because I had to leave so hopefully that doesn't set them on high alert uh, but we're gonna try and go back tonight sit in the same spot so it was Sunday night, I just got home, got all the gear loaded back into the garage. Uh, but really, a slow night, uh, was super windy out, really warm. I uh, saw two deer off in the homeowner's front yard. And then just as I was getting down, I had four deer come walking in. And I had to wait about 15 minutes for those guys to clear out. Finally threw a water bottle down to make sure they were all cleared away and got out of there. Uh, but it was a super eventful weekend, saw tons of deer. I just can't wait for the rut to really kick in because I, I saw probably 14 or 15 does this morning. And uh, once those once the rut kicks in, that's when the bucks will start showing up. So, well, it's turning out to still be quite an exciting season. Haven't shot one yet, but uh, time's coming. 
Thanks for following along. And as always, thanks for sticking around. We'll see you next time.